fans, this match is scheduled for one fall with TV time remaining. And it is for the NWA Mountain State Wrestling Heavyweight Championship. First, the challenger from Main Street, USA, weighing 295 pounds, Frank the Tank Parker! And his, and his opponent, escorted to the ring by Dynamite Derek Billings and the new television champion, Brian Kyle, from Raleigh, North Carolina, weighing 220 pounds. He is the NWA Mountain State Wrestling Heavyweight Champion, King Richard! Mark Hudgens, your referee. That's what it's all about, fans, the heavyweight title. And now Mark Hudgens checking to make sure that Frank the Tank Parker is clean. I'm sure he's going to do the same with King Richard. King Richard's saying that he doesn't cheat. He's like me saying, I don't like Taco Bell. You know, Jock? Yes. Mark Hudgens calling for the bell. Look at this. Already well, ganging up by Frank. It's going to be impossible for Frank the Tank Parker to win this match. Wait a minute now. King Richard. Get in the Check that guy for steroids. Check the guy for steroids. I think King Richard is uh, a little intimidated by the size of Frank the Tank Parker. Putting their heads together. And now going to a combined IQ of 50. Don't talk about Frank Parker like that. I've been told not to talk about Frank Parker like that by the gift garage. But King Richard slowly making his way into the ring. Heavyweight champion buying some time stolen. For Frank Zank Parker, he has a severe disadvantage here. Almost a three-on-one handicap match. The gift garage known for their interference. Well, what the referee Mark Hutchins should do is he should kick out Brian Kyle and Dynamite Derek Billings. That way, it can even up the odds. And Frank the Tank Parker has a, a chance to becoming a new heavyweight champion. But uh, I don't think that's going to happen. Because there's the thing that you're seeing, Jock. Every time Frank the Tank Parker got some offense, the gift garage interfered. Okay. Well, I guess King Richard found the tank's weakness already, the left leg. Now it's going to be even harder for Frank to win this match. Frank Parker down. Grab an ice pack, somebody! Now that don't tickle. The champion saying he didn't kick him in the testicles, he kicked him in the stomach. But that is false. That was a kick right in the nutsack. And King Richard on the offensive now using the rope to choke out Frank the Tank Parker. which allows for that double team effort. Smart by Frank though to move out of the way because what Brian Kyle would do is just non-stop attack. That's what would have happened. And now Tank Parker getting worked on by King Richard with big hands. Frank into that corner. Ooh. Did you hear that? No, 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 no. Very good. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Like, why, why am I watching Joppa? Kicked by Frank the Tank Parker. No open fist by Frank. Well, can you blame him? Whipping. Oh, King Richard catching Frank the Tank Parker with a boot. And oh, what a power slam by Frank the Tank Parker. Beautiful right there. You should see the, uh, the fans' expressions on their faces. I know everybody at home is, is saying the same thing. Wow. The champion trying to get up as well as the challenger. Looks like he can uh, 
Most men slowly get to their feet though, Jock. There you go. Good point, Jock. Now Frank the Tank Parker choking out King Richard. Here we go. Frank the Tank Parker throws King Richard down. Is it over? Referee Mark Hudgens only getting a two count there. Frank the Tank Parker a little frustrated by that. Well, if Frank the Tank Parker really thinks he's going to become the new heavyweight champion by a move like that, I, I'm sorry, but he's sadly mistaken. Uh, maybe a choke slam, a power drive, you know, a devastating move from the top rope. That might win the uh, match, you know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Frank the Tank Parker's going to have to pull out two or three good power moves. The gift of Raj getting extremely flustered that they are unable to help their de facto leader, King Richard. Well, I'm pretty sure they're going to come up with some kind of strategy here. Oh! Nice move by the champion. Kick right to the top. Following a punch right between the eyes. And King Richard now shoving Franklin Parker in the corner as he goes to work. On Frank and Frank Parker's knees. There you go. Brian Kyle about to put his two cents in. Five minutes has elapsed in the match. Five minutes. First. Oh! Back body drop by Frank the Tank Parker. And just like that, the tank explodes. Look, 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 look. There you go. There you have it. King Richard's going to cheat. And Frank the Tank Parker's got a few tricks up his sleeves. Uh, he might kill him. He's just choking him out there. Choking the life out of King Richard. The referee didn't even see it. Good, he gets what he did. Oh, oh, big boot to the head. I think he just imprinted that FP at the bottom of his boot on the forehead of King Richard. Dang. King Richard coming off the ropes. Chop block takes down. Big Frank the Tank Parker. Yeah, that's a big man right there to take down. And what better way to take him down to work on that leg? Frank the Tank Parker trying to shake it off. Oh, Frank the Tank Parker's knee just getting slammed into that mat by King Richard. Man, wow. Woo. Man, oh man. I think Frank the Tank Parker's in some severe pain out there. Yeah, he might as well just give up. Well, I can tell you, Frank the Tank Parker has not come this far to lose this match. For our fans at home that do not know, Frank the Tank Parker is a former heavyweight champion. He is. He is a former heavyweight champion. More than once. And now, think of Floyd Leglock applied by King Richard. And like Ric Flair, he's trying to use the ropes. But of body strength of Dynamite Derek Villains instead. Man, Frank the Tank Parker was screaming like he was dying. Wow. There it is again. Frank the Tank Parker in shearing pain, ladies and gentlemen. Mark Hutchins just, he needs to pay attention to Dynamite. I mean, it's just an accident waiting to happen. Uh-oh. Frank the Tank Parker getting some momentum. Frank the Tank Parker now fighting to get out of that figure four leg lock. Looks like a reverse. Oh, he does reverse one, King Richard. A little help from Brian Kyle to clear the rope. And King Richard now. And, oh, big head shot by Brian Kyle to Frank the Tank Parker. Almost. Two, three. Yeah. Apparently, yeah. I mean, King Richard thinks this two fingers up means three. Frank the Tank Parker is going to have to triple his effort here to win this match because it's just not fair for uh, the tank. And there goes Frank the Tank Parker's knee for sure, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, as much as Frank the Tank Parker deserves this beatdown, it's still not right. It's not fair, you know what I mean? Oh, what a, what a
what a devastating spinning toe hold by King Richard. I mean, all right, Frank with the punch to the gut. Oh, wow. Frank's head partner attempting to fight back and get off of his knees. Up he goes, ladies and gentlemen, and wow. Irish whip reversing. The med section take Frank the Tank Parker down again. Yes, the tank is definitely hurting right now. The wheels are just not rolling straight. We need a little oil to, to spice things up here. And Frank the Tank Parker getting tossed out as the entourage of King Richard, Brian Kyle, and Derek Billings goes to work on Frank the Tank Parker. Mark Hutchins, turn around. Look what's going on out there. And in the ring goes Frank the Tank Parker after getting the beat down by Gift Garage members Brian Kyle and Derek Billings. And you know, that definitely took out a lot of Frank the Tank Parker. It's bad enough that he's already in there giving it all he got. And then Brian Kyle and Dynamite just got to, you know, not even, even the odds. Just letting the tank suffer. Absolutely, Jock. And now King Richard stretching out the knee. Leg of Frank the Tank Parker. Ten minutes has elapsed in the match. Ten minutes. Even though Frank the Tank Parker can equal the amount of three people combined. Oh! All right. Nobody home. Until we see some offense out of Frank the Tank Parker now, ladies and gentlemen. That's good. Frank the Tank Parker with the reverse. Standing on that one leg. Trying to look like he's trying to walk it off. Frank the Tank Parker. Gaining momentum. Absolutely. Frank the Tank Parker. Wait a minute. No! That was a close one right there. You see, the leg gave out of Frank the Tank Parker. That's why he couldn't finish the power move. Absolutely, Jock. I was going to say that, but you beat me another punch. Great observation. And you have to think, Frank the Tank Parker's knees are like jelly now at this point. It's definitely complicated right now for the Frank the Tank Parker to, to, uh, to, uh, what was this? Wait a minute, Frank the Tank Parker fighting back. King Richard, off the ropes. Oh, wait a minute, is he gonna choke slam him? This is gonna be it! This is gonna be over! Wait, Carl! Wait, now Carl has been trying to tell Frank the Tank Parker about the fact that Frank is his, is his idol and he gives Ducky. He throws the duck and. Wait a minute, why did he bring the bell for Whoa! A low blow. Yeah. No, sir. Frank Hawk is disqualified for hitting the buck for it. Ladies and gentlemen, Mark Hudgens has disqualified Frank the Tank Parker for hitting the referee. Therefore, still, your heavyweight champion, King Richard. Jock, can you believe that? Ducky cost Frank the Tank Parker the match. Oh no, I can't believe that. I mean, come on, you know what I mean? That referee been in there getting tossed around like a rag doll, and Frank the Tank Parker throws. Oh. Wait a minute, Frank the Tank Parker's gonna trip Casey oh. Dex Jr. And Man. Ducky goes for a ride as well. Ducky flying 50 feet in the air. He ain't happy right now at Ducky. Oh, three points. Almost caught Ducky. Get a save, baby. You see that? This time. It's all right. Referee telling Frank Tank Parker he's got to get out of the ring. No, he's not. Wait a minute. It's not over. Tank is going to do something else. No. All right. Frank the Tank Parker just choke slamming J.C. Dykes Jr. and completely frustrated because Carl has been wanting to tell Frank the Tank Parker what he thought of him. Wow.